Guys, hi, how you doing? It's John from Splash. In today's video, I'm going to be talking to you all about snow foam. So what is snow foam and why do we need to use it? Well, basically what snow foam does is gets rid of up to 90% of the dirt that's on your car before we come in contact to it with our wash mitt. So we still need to wash our car, but the great thing about snow foam is it's removed a lot of that dirt. So we're not going to be dragging it all around and creating scratches or swirls. Our Alaska snow foam is a super high concentrate. So you really don't need to be using much of it. A little goes a very long way. I'm about to show you how to use it. So for today's demonstration, we're going to be using the trusted Karcher K4 full control pressure washer, which is really popular with the home detailer. You also need a foam lance bottle. And what this is going to do is connect straight to the Karcher. We'll be putting our snow foam inside with some water and then away we go. So guys, just make sure you follow the instructions that are on the bottle. <laughs> So now that we've put a nice thick coating of foam onto the car, what it's going to do is soak into the dirt that's on there. Now, you want to leave it for around five minutes, but obviously it depends on the conditions on the day that you're using it. The way you can tell whether it's ready to remove is when it starts to dry. Now, you can see here that on our car, it's starting to dry on this part of the wing. So what we're going to do is jet wash it all off now and not let it dry completely. so we've just jet washed all that foam off the car so it's now safe for us to use our shampoo and wash mitt to wash it as we would the snow foam has removed about 90 percent of the grime that was on the car so when it comes to washing it with a wash mitt there shouldn't be any fear of dragging any of that grime and creating scratches right guys there you have it i hope you found that video interesting and informative don't forget to hit the like share and subscribe button and hopefully we'll see you again on the next video